Dmitry Ivanovich Mendeleev was born to Ivan Pavlovich Mendeleev and Maria Dmitrievna Mendeleev on February 8, 1834, in Vekni, Aremziani, close to Tobox, Siberia. Mendeleev was the last child of his parents' 17 children and was raised as an Orthodox Christian. Mendeleev's father, who was a teacher, became blind, losing his teaching job as a result. This plunged the family into poverty. His mother had to start working and also rebuilt the abandoned glass factory owned by the family. But greater calamity befell the family when Mendeleev was 13, his father died, and the factory was destroyed by fire. Due to the family's misfortune in 1894, his mother took Mendeleev and his brother to Moscow and tried to enroll him at the Moscow University, but he was not accepted into the school. He then tried to get admitted into his father's alma mater at St. Petersburg, causing the family to relocate to St. Petersburg. Mendeleev attended the main pedagogical institute in 1850, where he graduated, but at this time, he contracted tuberculosis and moved to the Crimean Peninsula on the north side of the Black Sea. Five years later, Mendeleev became a science teacher at the Simferopol Gymnasium, but his health got better and he returned to St. Petersburg in 1857. From 1859 to 1861, while in Hidelberg, Mendeleev worked on the spectroscope and the capillarity of liquids, leading to the publication of his textbook, Organic Chemistry. The book won him the Dimidov Prize of Petersburg Academy of Sciences. Mendeleev married Fiozna Nikitichna Leshcheva in 1862 at the Church of Mikulayev Engineering Institute in St. Petersburg, where he taught. He also became a professor at the St. Petersburg Technological Institute in 1864, and the next year, he published his dissertation on the combination of water with alcohol and became a doctor of sciences due to his publication. During the years that Mendeleev served at St. Petersburg University, he completely transformed the university into an internationally recognized research center for chemistry. There were 56 known chemical elements as of 1863, but each year brought a new discovery of a new element. Although several other scientists had identified periodicity of elements, Mendeleev wrote another text Principles of Chemistry in 1868 to 1870, at what point he made the most important discovery. While attempting to classify the elements in the placement of their chemical properties, he noticed patterns which led to the postulating of his periodic table. After propounding the periodic table in 1871, Mendeleev left gaps in the table for elements that have not yet been known. He went ahead to predict the supposed properties of three of the elements he thought could be found. Though this brought him opposition from other scientists, Mendeleev got fame as the founder of the periodic table law after many of his predictions came to pass within his lifetime. He went on to develop the extended version of the periodic table and made a formal presentation of the dependence between the properties of the atomic weight of the element to the Russian Chemical Society on March 6, 1869. Still, he was dismissed by some people for predicting more elements would be discovered. Mendeleev, who was still married, became in love with Anna Ivanova Popova in 1876 and his obsession during their courtship led him to threaten to commit suicide if she refused to marry him after he proposed in 1881. She agreed to the proposal and a month after they were married on 2nd April 1882, Mendeleev divorced his wife. He was considered a bigamist for his action as the Russian Orthodox Church demanded at least seven years before another marriage can be deemed lawful. This along with the controversy of his predictions, caused him not to be admitted to the Russian Academy of Sciences. But he still achieved the honor of scientific organizations all over Europe, including being elected as a foreign member of the Royal Society in 1892, being appointed director of the Bureau of Weights and Measures in 1893, and receiving the Davy Medal for the Royal Society of London. Besides the creation of the periodic table, Mendeleev helped in finding the first Russian oil refinery. He was one of the founders of the Russian Chemical Society in 1869. He made contributions that were important to determine the nature of the indefinite compounds as solution and is given credit 
for his introduction of the metric system to the Russian Empire. Mendeleev was elected into the Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences as a member in 1905 and two years later, in 1907, Mendeleev died in St. Petersburg after suffering from influenza. He was 72 years at his bedside. His last words were, Doctor, you have signs, I have faith. Several establishments have been named after Mendeleev in his honor, few of which are the D.I. Mendeleev Institute for Metrology in St. Petersburg, a monument of Mendeleev and his periodic table at the National Metrology Institute, a Dmitry Mendeleev's Memorial Museum apartment at the St. Petersburg State University. He was also honored in Moscow with the naming of the D. Mendeleev University of Chemical Technology of Russia. There is also a synthetic chemical element called Mendelevium after him with a large lunar impact crater located at the far side of the moon bearing the name Mendeleev. Mendeleev, who is often referred to as the father of the periodic table due to the naming of this table, the periodic system, was also the father of six children. And in his honor, a Mendeleev Golden Medal was established by the Russian Academy of Sciences and awarded occasionally to winners. Thank you very much for watching our videos. We'll appreciate it if you subscribe to our channel and share this video with your friends. We love you.